All right, guys, so we saw the front house already. Now I'm going to show you the yard. We'll look at that, at that last house last. Uh, but let me just show you the yard because this is something that's going to be really cool. For those of you who are contractors, who have a business, who need some space for a shop, this is it. Okay, you're close to town, great part of town with almost two and a half acres. So you saw the front house. It's beautiful. Uh, now we're going to look at the shop. And the shop, this yard space, obviously you can see the front uh, where we came from. But uh, the, 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 the boundary is that fence right over there. I'll walk over to it. So it starts at this fence and it goes all the way down. We'll see a wooden fence over there in a little bit. And this nice driveway, gravel driveway, that goes all the way to the back. Okay, so uh, all that space, that manufactured home is included. All that, all that parking space is included. And uh, let's look at this stuff they have over here, okay? Um, they have a lot of a covered area. Now this does need a little bit of work. It needs new uh, roofing, roofing sheets, but... Uh, for those of you that need outdoor space, this is amazing, right? This is actually, now if you don't need it, you can knock it down. But uh, it'd be a shame because this, this is a great structure. Cover it up. you got a huge working area. It has nice gravel already in place. It has this other garage over here. Now, that front house does have its own two-car garage. But look at this. They even have room. This, this is like a 40-foot long RV, and you hardly even notice it here because the yard is so big. So this property line starts right about here and it goes all the way down to that fence line, okay? So even this 40-foot RV is kind of dwarfed by the property size, okay? All right, so the property, and right over there is, uh, you can see on, on my right, that's Golden Valley High School. So you're right up against, that's your neighbor. You have this nice shop over here. Oh, sorry. Let me... Yeah, this nice shop. And I noticed that um, that there is two meters. So there's two electric meters. Um, one goes to that house, and then and the power line comes all the way through here, and then connects to that house. But they do they do have a they do have a um, uh, that looks like a 50 amp, maybe a 30 amp, but just just for the RV to plug into that shop over there, right? Uh, that could be certainly be fixed up and reused. I wouldn't mind using it at all. You know, even this this shed over here. If you have tools, if you have a business. This stuff it doesn't come doesn't come cheap, right? So to find even stuff like this is is an excellent value. And you have all this space here still. You have all this space to, to park trucks and vehicles and trailers and whatever else you need. Or if you if you want to do a hobby farm, you have plenty of room to, to start a garden. So there's a ton of opportunities, ton of potentials for this for this two and a half, well, almost two and a half acres. Okay, so let's take a walk just to show you what the what the land looks like. And this is why I had to shoot this in multiple videos, because this is a lot of walking. Two and a half acres is, uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to walk to the end over here and, and then uh, stop this video. Otherwise, this video will be too long as well. So I'm just going to raise you up a little bit and let you see what's included. All the way down to Golden Valley High School. Listen to how quiet it is out here. You can hardly hear any traffic. Just birds. And wildlife sometimes I see little lizards crawling around. He's all the way back over here. So look at that, from fence line to fence line, beautiful school behind you, it's very quiet right now, you get all this space from here all the way, you can actually see, if you look way over there, you can see that, that purple tree, that's how far your property is. If you have need for space, this is it. Okay, I'm going to stop this video now, next time I'm going to jump into that manufactured home in the middle and let you see that as well, okay? Any questions, give me a call. Let's go over there next.